Hi, my name is Patty Wood Finkel and I'm the Collections Manager at the Earth and Mineral Sciences Museum and Art Gallery here in the Dyke Building within the College of EMS and we would like to welcome you to our new gallery space. We were closed for two years for renovations and as you can see we have lovely bamboo floors, new LED overhead lighting which is better for the objects and the art as well as the ability to move the cases around and rearrange the gallery as we need to. We'll have new exhibits coming in regularly and we hope that you will come and visit us whenever you have a chance. This map of Pennsylvania was created for the 1893 Columbian Exposition World's Fair in Chicago. It was later brought to the Earth and Mineral Sciences newly opened museum and has moved around a couple of times since then. If you look closely at the map, you'll see that not only is it hand carved and hand painted, but the lettering is also hand done. A really impressive feat. This exhibit is part of a student collaboration. Hidden Landscapes, an exploration of Earth's mantle was created in conjunction with fourth year undergraduate student Angelina Santamaria. While doing her research, she noticed how beautiful the thin sections she was exploring were, and she wanted to share that with the community. Working with the museum staff, she was able to create this exhibit that featured not only her research, but also the artistic beauty of the thin sections she was working with. The museum values working with students, so we have been working with the EMS Sustainability Group on campus, the newly formed student group specifically, to try to create exhibits that will inform the student body about what they can do in their everyday lives to be more sustainable. This exhibit is just the first step in a series of exhibits that we hope will help educate the students about what they can do. This is our Evan Pugh exhibit. Evan Pugh was the first president of Penn State, but before he was the president, he was a student and a scientist. This exhibit explores his time as a student in Germany, working on his PhD, as well as his time as a scientist in England, solving the nitrogen question. The hot topic of the day was whether nitrogen was introduced to plants via the soil or the air, and Evan Pugh solved that conundrum. This is our blue and white exhibit. It's one of our most popular exhibits in the museum and currently features a variety of blue and white minerals. You can see that we have a beautiful azurite on the top as well as stunning quartz crystals. Thanks for watching this video. If you're interested in learning more about the museum, you can visit us at our website or visit our socials on Facebook and Instagram.